I mean, it was really fun to like just hold a little piggy. They're cute. They're cute. I, I had, I totally had my babe experience, <laughs> um, you know, and it's true. It's like holding a small dog. The pig took to me. <laughs> we feel strongly that, you know, at the very least, we know where our, our pork comes from. We know the diet it's being raised on, and we know the people who are raising these animals. I have uh, competed on Iron Chef America. I've been a guest judge on Chopped, Rachel Ray versus Guy. It's fascinating. People are like, I loved you on Top Chef. I'm like, that was like 2005. So there's just been all this, you know, wonderful sort of opportunity that's happened for me since Top Chef. I left New York so I could come to Hawaii and be here and, um, you know, just be in a beautiful place. Open up my first restaurant, Coco Hood Cafe, is my first independent project. I'm partnered with Kevin Henney. Uh, who is also co-owner of this restaurant and um, you know we're just having a great time we like to say that you know brunch all day um, and it seems to be Hawaii is kind of the perfect place for it where people you know wake up late come in and they can have exit two in the afternoon if they want I think there's a sensitivity when women are in the kitchen in terms of how they cook you know what yeah. they cook for um, there's been a lot of debate on women chefs versus male chefs anytime you see a, a woman succeeding in general, in life, you have to be like, yeah, you know, so it's not just for chefs. Um, that being said, I, I want I want to see more young women cooks here. I want to see more young ladies going coming out of culinary school ready to take on the world.